November day 19 uh, also happens to be International Men's Day. Go figure. Uh, so this morning I'm just off to go and meet the person who inspired uh, Meaningful Miles and checking in. We're going to go do a few laps at Regent's Park and then grab a coffee. Uh, then the rest of my day is stacked. I've got a mental health and wellness webinar with KPMG. Uh, that's just following on from Sky last week, which is cool. Uh, I've then got Running With A Purpose, which is a London running club, similar kind of thing. And then this evening I've got Boys Talk. So with the New Normal Charity, it's a peer support group for men, uh, led by Jack and Ben, London Barber. Um, the last one a couple of weeks ago was really, really good, so we're looking forward to tonight. <coughs> See how the rest of the day goes. Um, please keep your donations coming in. Don't forget uh, that you can win one of these. Particularly lovely Fact 02. Uh, we've got about 10 days left for the draw. So 20 quid to enter the raffle. Links will on my website in my profile. And I'll be making the draw midnight on the 29th, I think. Uh, so yeah, please donate, 20 pounds. Cheers. folks at Factor Bikes have given me one of these to give away. Factor O2 frame set. Not this one, because this one's mine, but one in your size. So along with Factor, I'm also giving away a load of goodies from Gillette UK and Muck Off next week. Um, so if you're around and want to ride, and want a coffee and want to check in, um, hit me up. So tomorrow I'm riding with Juan Antonio Fletcher, um, who you might know from Eurosport, uh, ex-pro, uh, lives now in London and uh, in between London and Barcelona, I think. Um, so looking forward to catching up with him tomorrow. Um, tomorrow is also the anniversary of, it's quite a big day, it's the anniversary, third anniversary uh, of me outing myself and talking publicly about what I did um, and what I went through. Um, I put a post on Instagram on the 20th of November 2017 um, and told the world that um, I tried to kill myself twice. And that was probably, probably one of the, actually that wasn't the hardest thing. Uh, telling my family and friends was the hardest thing. Um, that kind of led me on to what I'm doing now. So. Tomorrow's quite a big day. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks to Harriet for today. Um, anyone else that's ridden with me so far, and everyone I've got lined up over the next couple of weeks. Um, also thanks to Harriet for giving me the inspiration to do this. Um, we bumped into each other in, in Rafa in Soho a couple of weeks ago, or probably a month ago now, uh, when I cancelled London to Manchester and back. And she told me what she wanted to do uh, in the previous lockdown about checking in on friends. Um, and, you know, just meeting up and having a beer or having a coffee somewhere. Um, and that really inspired me to do this whole checking in over the next few months. Um, this isn't just a Movember challenge, although I'm, I'm raising money and awareness for Movember. Um, this is something I'm looking to carry on through 
as long as possible, really. Um, so I could do with your help if you'd like to help support me as long as as well as donating to my member. I've got a crowdfunding page, um, and that will help get me through to hopefully the end of January. Um, and hopefully I can encourage you to do the same and make sure that over the next few months uh, you're just checking in with friends, family. Um, doesn't take much. Text, coffee, beer, ride, whatever it is. Um, just say hi and make sure someone's okay. Yeah, please do the same and see you soon.